Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and today we're going to make oatmeal raisin nut cookie. But we're going to use the einkorn flour that we got from einkorn.com. Okay, here in the cowgirl, we have one cup or a half a pound of butter. And you're going to need a cup and a half of packed brown sugar, one cup of raisins, two eggs to which I've added a teaspoon of vanilla, one and a quarter cups of flour. I'm using the, the einkorn wheat flour to which I've added a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice and a teaspoon of baking soda and a half a cup of pecan pieces. Okay, as always, we always start out by creaming our butters and our sugars together. Then I'm going to add in my eggs and my vanilla. Now I'm going to put my dough hook on and now I'm just going to drop in our flour, our baking soda and our pumpkin pie spice, our nuts and our raisins. That's why we have the dough hook. I almost forgot the most important ingredient, the oatmeal. For this recipe you're going to need three cups of large flake oatmeal. Now, a one liter or a quart jar is four cups, so you only need three quarters of, of a jar. Or I'm only going to use three quarters of a jar. And there we go, three cups of large flake oatmeal. Okay, so these are going into a 350 degree oven for 12 to 15 minutes. And here they are. This recipe makes anywhere between 22 and 42 cookies, depending on the size that you make your cookie balls. So these are the oatmeal raisin cookies with pecans, as you requested. Mm -hmm. They're good. Well, of course they are. It's my recipe. <laughs> Thanks, baby. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying oatmeal raisin nut cookies. Nothing gives you a warm hug on a cold winter's day more than that recipe will. Take care. God bless.